Hello, entrepreneurs. Joe DeCharis, serial entrepreneur that with the CPA license, coming to you live from downtown Flushing, New York, for another amazing version of how to win at business. And tonight's going to be a short one. So if you're watching live, give me a hashtag live. If you're not watching, don't give me any hashtag. And if you're watching a replay, give me a hashtag replay. And tonight, we're just talking about the the temporary meals deduction. Did you know, did your accountant tell you that for the next two years, actually it started January 1st, 2021, and it's going to go to the end of 2022, that you we can deduct 100% of our meals, of our qualified meals. There's, there's always... Uh, another thing, and and I'll tell you what it is. It's pretty simple. The the statute was passed to to help restaurants that that were affected by COVID, which is all of them. So if you eat your meal, a business meal in a restaurant, that's going to be a hundred percent deductible. So. But if you go to a place where they sell like processed foods, like uh, grocery stores, bars, uh, fast food, that, that doesn't count. They want you to have a meal at a real restaurant. It's pretty simple. And so you have to tell your accountant when you're, when you're spending money on meals, if you want to get the right deduction, you're going to have to tell them, Hey, these were restaurant expenses and these were regular meals that don't qualify for the 100%, but we still can get the 50% deduction. So that's my story. I'm sticking with it. If, if you want any tax tips, advice about your business, I welcome you. I invite you to, to book a chat with me, timewithjoe.com, and also to... Uh, join our mastermind group. We've got a great uh, mastermind group. It's still free. We have a lot of fun. We play Japardi. And, and all you have to do is go to mastermindwithjoedechara.com and you're in. Okay, God bless. I will see you again shortly. Thank you. Oh, I thought he ended the broadcast. <laughs>